Good morning, guys. It's Sunday morning. We're going to Korean this morning or this afternoon. It's a zoo in here. It's a zoo. Making, Laura's making breakfast. The kids are jumping. My dog, Ruby, out there. There's a baby chasing Macy. And Toby. Toby's the brave one. Toby. Are you the brave one? Toby? Toby. Oh, look at that. Somebody piled up all the shoes. Now nobody can get through the door. <laughs> it is scorching out. Yesterday was rainy and dark and dreary. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Yeah, I look the same as yesterday. It's been crazy. It's been a lot crazy, but so much fun. Anyway, we are at the dog beach. And we're big chickens. We, and we're big chickens, says Molly. Can you please drop Ruby off? All right, well, let's see if we can get her in the water first. Get a stick and we'll, and we'll see if we can get her to swim. So basically, the girls want to swim. They're being picked up in less than an hour. It's almost 11, so a little over an hour. Okay, watch this. Like over a leash. She's like, I'm not doing it. <laughs> this way is actually a bit warmer. Come, on, come, on, come here, big. Don't pull her. Brave girl. You guys thought she was just a little tiny, quiet girl, but really, she's the bravest of us all. Let's do this. Yeah, Don't push her. Oh, let go of her leash. Let go of her leash, Gabby. Bring her down deeper. Don't let water get in her ears. <laughs> that girl. Oh. I need you to come in. Let, let me hold you. You're holding me. Let me hold you. Okay, now go. <laughs> As I fall in head over feet. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I go. <laughs> Good job, though. Poor Ruby. That's freezing cold. She is not the water dog your dad thought she was. Um, hey, Le Miss uh, Towel Girl. Good job, Sophie. So that was kind of a fail, but we are headed over to the real beach so that the girls can have a little swim before they go home. And then we are headed, and then we're headed home so I can have a shower, and then we are going someplace so cool, horse related, that you won't even believe it. I'm gonna sit myself on this big rock and listen to them scream. For a reference, you guys might not know, but in May in Canada, the water is still freezing cold. And that's why they're so afraid. Yeah, here we go. Chase me, Charlie. Whoa. Whoa, this is ox for you guys. Whoa. Okay, let's do Ruby. Ruby can do high.
said it in a recent vlog that we're doing something so super fun this weekend, and we are. We are racing to the A Circuit Trillium Horse Show. It's our very first horse show ever, and it's the A Circuit, and we're super excited. But this is what happened. First of all, we had to wait for all of our guests to leave. They were supposed to leave by noon, but it was more like one by the time they left. So then we were late. So then we needed to rush home and have a shower and get clean. So we rushed home and we realized it was way too late for us to have a shower. So we just washed up and I needed to do my hair. Then I realized I forgot all the brushes and all the curling irons and all the stuff that I needed to do my hair at the trailer. So then we just did what we could do with our hair. Girls are all crazy haired. And we uh, threw on our clothes, our clean clothes, and we jumped in the car. And when we got in the car, I realized, we don't know what you wear to a horse show. Like, what do spectators wear to a horse show? And then I started thinking, maybe we have to dress fancy. And literally, I have a hoodie and some shorts. And Sam has a t-shirt and some shorts. Trillium looks like. In the ring for her second trip in our Trillium Hunter is entry number 155.
That was good. That's her heart. That's a heart for her. <laughs> All the horses are stalled at the at the show. We're gonna go find Jesse. Wow, look at this, you guys. This is what it's gonna look like when we come. Look at that cute horse. Bandit, his name is Bandit. He just had a drink and he's so nice. I want to buy you. Oh my god, so cute. We're probably in somebody's setup and we don't even know. We better get out of here and find our Rafiki. Oh, such a cute pony. We found Nikki. Amazing. It was Jesse. So, how'd you do at Trillium? First time at Trillium. Not bad. Um, we missed a lead in almost every course. Uh, metal did fantastic. So on our first course, it was pretty well done. We were a little rushy because, you know, it was our judge schooling. Uh, so that was pretty bad, but it's okay. We got that one out of the way. It didn't really count. Second schooling was not bad. And then our first actual course, we did fairly well and we missed one lead and then I asked the judge and she said I was one away from serve. Out of That's amazing. First time yeah, at Trillium. Yeah, pretty good. And then second course, I got like 11th out of 19th. Still not bad considering I was against a lot of expensive horses and mine's only, I got mine for like 1500 Yeah, amazing. Not bad about that. And our third course, still pretty good. Around the 10th area. Um, and our and medal was like fantastic. But... Like I would have placed, but I forgot to hold at the end. Aww. Yeah, I probably would have been like third and up. Oh, so. Which is really frustrating, but. But what did you get? Uh, and then I got third in our flat. Amazing. So this is Lola's very first show. How'd you do, Lola? Hey, how'd you do at your She's very like, first I show? Amazing, yeah. She's like, I hated it. She did not like it, did she? But look at her little braid. Whoops. <laughs> We've been looking at everything. We've been looking at all the horses to see what they look like. We've been looking at their braids. And yeah, this is gonna be a lot of work for us. Like Jesse was telling us all the hacks that you have to do. Look how nice this farm is though. Right, there's my dream pony right there. Who doesn't love a white pony, a white horse? He's huge and gorgeous. Everyone who already owns a horse and everyone who um and everyone who um, has to take care of it. Yeah, I love that horse. Yeah. Look at that horse definitely looks like Storm. And he moves his head like Storm. Well, that was super fun. I loved it. I honestly was like a bit worried about the show thing. It was super chill and I made a mistake. Trillium is not A circuit, it's just below A circuit. So, but yeah, it was so fun. And Gabby, do you want to show there? Uh, I don't know. She wants to show somewhere and get some show miles on her and her horse for a little um, first before she decides anything. But yeah, it was really cool. We got to see the um, a couple of horses from our barn, our show, and yeah, it was really fun. I really enjoyed it. But there was some stuff that really bothered me, and there was some stuff that I wasn't expecting. I learned so much, like put baby powder on their socks before you. I already knew that. That's oh. a life hack. Oh, is that a life hack? Life hack number. No. Life hack number 13. Anyway, um, so one horse that was there gave its rider a really hard time, dumped three riders, um, was apparently not acting behaved, so they took away the horse's food and water. They just took it away, they dumped the water, somebody came along, 
a while later and gave the horse water and the horse was drinking like crazy and then the person came along again and dumped the water again because apparently if you don't behave at a show you don't get food or water I think that's horrible that was really hard for me to see there's a man coach that that did that and I just can't believe that they do that like if that was our horse and somebody ever did that to our horse because our horse misbehaved I'd be like no like it's not gonna happen I would be too like there that would not happen to my horse because I think you're a better person if you just realize that realize that horses are people too and yeah it's not their fault I think but anyway yeah that was super fun and tomorrow we are doing something else that is super fun hopefully it's even more fun but that was huge for us that was our first show experience like outside of our barn show experience like I learned a lot and I'm obsessed and I'm addicted and I can't wait to go back. I'm excited again for the girls show. Now we are at Costco before we go back to the trailer. Oh yeah, they're nice. Those, are they the color changing ones? Oh, I like that. We have a couple at our trailer. 20 bucks for one? For two. 20 bucks for two. I love them. I really like those. Yeah, see? So, yeah. Oh, Mom. That is a massive box of fireworks. Massive box, 249 bucks. Should have had that this weekend. Yeah, nice bike. Too small, the bikes are here, here are too small for us. Except for, for Sophie. Sophie's got one that fits her. You guys have good bikes though. You have good working bikes. Have you ever just gone and tried on glasses just because mm -hmm. you like to? Sophie found these ones and they're cute. I like them. They match your shirt. You don't, you don't buy glasses unless you need them. I need them. I can't see. I, on the other hand, I need to get a new pair pronto. Um, I hate buying glasses. I hate trying them on. day away actually and again we're gonna have some fun stuff to do tomorrow I'm excited to share something else with you another um, new experience for us anyway I forgot to mention that one of the big things that we were excited about at Trillium was that I thought we were gonna get to see horses there like I've heard that people bring their horses there to sell them so I thought there would be like a bunch of horses for sale like nice quality good horses and there were none and I asked about it and they said no you have to talk to the people ahead of time and ask them to bring their horses and yeah we didn't know so we didn't get to see any horses there and that was super disappointing another thing that was super disappointing about our plans today was that we went to watch Jessie if you guys don't know we feature her sometimes in our videos because she's a friend of ours and we go to the same barn um, but we went to go watch her compete today and we thought she was showing in the afternoon we had to wait for all of our guests to leave and we raced to the show and uh, we missed Missed her so we didn't get to see but she did really well she got third place um, on her flat class and you guys already saw because I talked to her but anyway that is it for today the girls are outside jumping if you just saw Gabby and Ruby out there um, when the barn friends were here today they were in love with Ruby jumping I think they were shocked that she can fly but anyway, I'm going to end today's video and we're going to see you tomorrow and um, this is our first show experience today and it was really exciting for us. I hope you guys liked it. Um, let me know in the comments below if you want to see more stuff like that because I'm really interested in going to more shows. Our very first show is June 27th, I think, and I'm really excited now. I before felt a little overwhelmed and intimidated by the whole show thing, just listening to people talk, but when we were there today, that was the top show in our 
in our level and it was so chill and so much less dramatic than I thought it was going to be that I'm like, I can't wait until we show now. Anyway, that is it for today. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.